With a pristine coastline and wealth of natural beauty, it's not difficult to see why Mozambique is an attractive holiday destination, or why those in the tourism business would set up shop here. Mozambique is, a, is a also the, the open market for Africa now. I do believe that Mozambique will be a, a leading tourism destination in the coming five years. We just need to, 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 to push and polish what we have and, and make it shine. Here in Pemba, business could be better. There's been a slump in visitor numbers, with investor interest in a recent gas discovery overtaking tourism. I'd like to see tourism develop here because I know that it will help us earn a living as artists and improve our lives. But there aren't many now, and so our life is hard. This place is so beautiful with great beaches, and tourism in Cabo Delgado province is growing, but there are difficulties to overcome. Right now, we are lacking the necessary infrastructure for tourists. Many people here feel that Mozambique's tourism industry is critical in helping boost the local economy and infrastructure development, as well as supporting local livelihoods. Apart from the uh, foreign exchange, uh, it provides uh, jobs. It really provides jobs for the locals. Uh, it is a, a, a sector that uh, in Mozambique, for instance, about almost 50% are women. Last year, the total income from tourism-related activity in Mozambique exceeded 1.1 billion US dollars. Some 700,000 people were directly or indirectly employed in travel and tourism, and it's thought the sector will grow by more than 6% each year over the next decade, well above the global average. This year, the government cited the tourism sector as a priority for its long-term development plan, but those in the business cite high travel costs, laborious visa application processes and corruption as obstacles to realising its full potential. Mozambique's tourism authority is also keen to cast its net wider in the industry. Our, our source market, uh, so far about uh, more than 60% 60, 60 of our source market is South Africa. So we want to, to diversify. We look at Asia, for instance Asia has really a priority for us. Today, more people than ever before are banking on Mozambique's tourism sector taking off. But some fear that unless barriers to this are overcome quickly, the Southern African nation may lose out to other nearby holiday destinations. Clementine Logan, CCTV, Pemba, Mozambique.